Job 39, verse 17, in the Good News Translation. It was I who made her foolish and did not give her wisdom. Call all ye how by Shem, Yahweh Shah by Shem. Rakakadash, the bondage to the elders and the apostles of great millstone, rule well and teach well. Shallow unto the old feet like men that scattered abroad, pushing the truth without sincerity. And shallow unto a very, very few sincere sisters that's taking heed and getting in order as well. Right, um, brother, I'm gonna want to come to the video a little when it's edifying, right? Just you know, excuse <clears throat> me, backing off with um, the brother, right? You should already know Saints of Jersey, it's Paige, <clears throat> hey, um, quickly, you know, did a lesson on this right here on this small topic, you know, and you know, just just um, you know, going over it as well, but it's just stating the point, man. This is why we don't go back and forth with women, you know, it's with the scriptures. Debate, period. You shouldn't be debating with them, period, because you're just talking to a wall. You know, it's it's just each and every day is just showing you the it's showing you proof that the Lord did not give them wisdom. Because look, this is how, this is what they're talking about. You know, I'm gonna let this video play and I ain't really I really only just had two scriptures just to bring out, <laughs> you know, in, in two translations, you know, and just hitting the point real hard. Right? So let's listen to this folly right quick. Right, and it's funny, man, because us men in this truth, man, we we laugh at this because we already know, we man, the days are real, real short to where these types of women, right? You could tell that she's, you know, with the with the alphabet community, right? She gonna be one of them. She gonna be one of the main ones looking for a man of the Lord in that day, man. <laughs> Isaiah four one, you know, and um, hey. She'll be getting denied, you know, unless you repent, <laughs> right? But for the main part, man, it, the, the alphabet community, man, hey, you don't really see them trying to uh, 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 repent, you know? But look at the madness she's spewing out. So let me go back to that um scripture again, right? Job 39 and 17. It was I who made her foolish, right? <laughs> it was I who made her foolish. And this is why when you hear this, you just let it, let them have it. Right, it says lacking good sense or judgment, unwise. Right, foolish going to what? Stupid. Right, <laughs> it says stupid. Right, because who, who, where do you think you come from? You come from the man. You, come, you had to come from a seed. You know. You know, we just make like I say. You know, making this lesson just for you know edifications, edification's sake. Right. <laughs> So you can get understanding, right? But you have scriptures like, you know, like, well, the brother pretty much went into it. You know, I'll also leave his link, you know, on the description box, right? Going into Genesis 2 and 3, right? How the woman came from, uh, how, first, how Yahweh brought up men first, then created the women. You know, Corinthians 11, how the Lord has set the order, you know? Man, this right here was just, <laughs> I seen, I was just like, man, I just, just want to do a quick, you know, quick, just quick, small video on it. I'm trying to figure out. In fact, you've never been necessary. And 
trying to figure out where I had one. Uh, start at. Prior to you existing, there was no man. There were only womans. And they were not she's, they were they's. Because they possessed both the masculine and the feminine. They were like trees. So pretty much you're trying to say that was like, what the hell she is. <laughs> Right, because she don't she don't consider herself no, no no female. She wanna be a man, right? She don't play both sides of the field. I mean, these women is wicked, man. I ain't even gonna hold you on these scriptures, right? <laughs> I'm gonna close out with this last one. Right, you made a foolish man. This shit is madness. Um Proverbs. Nine. 13 in the good news translation. Right? It says stupidity is like a loud, ignorant, shameless woman. Right? I'm not all right. So so with this a hey, even though she was talking in, in in a smooth, you know, calm voice, right? But she was most definitely screams at the top of her lungs when she's confident in this, man. Right? Confident and, and, and shameless of um she has no shame in what spewing out this craziness, man. Right? Stupidity is like a loud, ignorant, shameless woman. Right? At the end of the day, she's a female. Right, so let's get the let's get the um definition of stupidity. <laughs> Behavior that shows a lack of good sense or judgment, right? Lack of intelligence, foolishness, right? That's going to show you, man. That this lady is foolish, right? Hey, that's why we know that they mainly of them two thirds is is a lot of women, right? They is blind like bats out of hell, <laughs> right? But I ain't gonna hold you on this. I'm just close it out with that. I just want to just do a small response, you know. Lord willing, this was edifying. And hey, brothers, when you man, you come around women like this, man, man, just keep walking, man, because this shit is wild. But just know, these, a lot of these women gonna be at brothers' doorsteps, right? When shit start hitting the fan, when shit start getting real, these women gonna forget all that shit they've been talking, all these theories, scenarios, whatever they got, but whatever she's saying, and and and, and the woman that's saying similar things to it. All that shit will come to season when Jacob Trouble pop off. All right, till next time I say Shalom, low one is edifying.